State legislators from across Bristol County gathered at the Fall River campus for a breakfast presentation delivered by BCC President Dr. John Spraga. President Spraga encouraged the lawmakers to continue their commitment to fully funding BCC in the upcoming FY 2016 budget cycle despite projected deficits. He used the occasion to promote the many successes at BCC, one of which is its commitment to workforce education. Jeremy Souza dropped out of high school at age 16 and after being out of work, entered BCC to earn his high school diploma. Souza says he'll continue his education at the college and urged lawmakers to not cut this vital educational lifeline for many displaced workers. It's, it's empowering to know that there are jobs out there that I couldn't apply for in that 15 months ago and now I'm available. I just want us to be able to invest more in education and into this program for the people like me who are yet to walk through the door. President Spraga also touted the ongoing physical growth of the college with a new building being constructed in Fall River and plans for expansion in Attleboro and New Bedford. And with the city of Taunton getting its new one-stop location earlier this year, State Senator Mark Pacheco is looking to ensure BCC retains a foothold in the Silver City. Having a center in Taunton it makes a huge difference. It's extremely important. The entire Bristol County delegation is fighting to make sure we get the uh, acquisition of the Taunton facility uh, concluded and that we are able to ascertain this $3.2 million that we need to upgrade the facilities and bring it up to code so we can have that facility not only for this generation but future generations to come. Senator Pacheco remains hopeful that BCC will continue to receive top priority as the legislature begins its work on the fiscal year 2016 spending plan.